Hey guys, welcome back to A Slice of Gaming, the only pie turn four back with more Mario and Luigi's Bowser's inside story for the Nintendo DS. And it looks like those barricades have finally left, or Bowser just went and destroyed them, so we can take a look around a bit, not that there's much that we have access to anyways, other than these items up here, which are always nice to get too. I don't think there's anything over there. Looks like we'll have to come back and invade this place with Bowser when we have him back in the party. What was here? Oh yes, it was just the entrance to the caves. Nobody cares. So, let's go back inside Bowser now that we've explored around. Wait! You're the first sage, right? We need to talk to you. Wait! Mario, Luigi, get it together! Follow that bug! Yes, ma'am. Of course, it has to go into the spot where we haven't been quite yet. First, I'm going to make a stop here. Hey, did you know that Peach's castle has been invaded? Yeah, we know about this. We better not burden him with too many other things. This toad down here still is selling stupid crap. So I guess we can save our money. So let's go chase after that bug then. Hey, this is where I tried to explore. I love how the cutscene is doing these jumps for me. Oh, I got away! There's gotta be a way past this barrier. But it's beyond us now. Until Dr. Toadley finds out the location of the other sages, we should stick around this area. There's no way Bowser can get the star first dark here anyways. Little tickle in the old snooze. Probably chippy or something. Hm, time to get that star here before Mario. Which way to Jimble Woods? Alright, let's go on our adventure now with Bowser. <gasps> it's broke, madame. Ooh. We can definitely be massagers. Slowly but surely, we are collecting the biddies. Guess we should heal him up. I don't even know what his HP is. I think he was weak the last time I remember. Do you have anything new in your store? Doesn't really look that way. No new items, I would assume. Do I have any more awards for this? Brown Bubble Lake. I think that's where we're going next anyways. No new reward. Oh, yeah. Oops. Let's go into this area and get ourselves a, a massage. Oh. Please tell me. A monsieur arrives. Let's see what the Brock Madame looks like. Oh dear. Oh dear. I know. <laughs> so, this is sudden, I know. But can you get started, Sherry? What, lady? What in the world are you talking about? Oh, mon chéri. Surely you are applying for the monsieur position? Monsieur? Are you out of your mind? Me? Massage you? I don't even know you. Oh, 
Ah, Sutalos, I thought I was sure. <laughs> ah, I must apologize to you. I am Rogue Madame. This is my humble abode. You see, of late, the pain has been very terrible. The stress is savages, the shoulders, and the back. That is why I await the professional massage. <sighs> ah, mon chéri, you are the burly sort. Could you try? Do you know the massage art? Of course, but I have no time. Find some other poor sap. Talk about crazy. I get massages. I don't give them. Ah, I will pay. Pay? That works. <laughs> the bait, you take it. You are eager, home. But we, I will pay you. I will pay the finest gear. Mm, this is kind of below my pay grade, but I gotta take what I can get. Fine, fine, a quick shoulder rub. Maybe some lumbar. Lie down. Huh? Hey, I appreciate the Azubi enthusiasm, Lee. But the knots and stiffness are too severe for that. The rubbing it will not work on such awful pain, huh? Fine, so what then? Hmm. Gura! Ritos? How oh, is this is? Bowser's strongest military division, the Goomba Corps. Strongest? Ah, oh, we. Oh, that will do nicely. So then, Monsieur Bowser, is it? This is what I call you. So is it powerful soldier of yours? They will be supplying the massage for more. The Goombas? Huh, interesting. Ready for massage duty? <laughs> eh, uh... If you say so. Great, well, whatever. Let's review the terms. My boys will launch an attack on your step back, right? Hehe, <laughs> oui, très bien. Make these soldiers attack as long as they can. The kings, they have a mighty hold on my back. Show them more no mercy. Take it to the limit. I'll try it out, I guess. Where's your husband doing in all this, by the way? So then, see if we play. So this is basically like the challenge thing for Bowser. In case you're interested in doing it, I suppose. Goombas. All right, I guess we'll. Oops, I wanted to try it again there. This is what happens when I don't have my handy dandy mouse. You can only hit them. Uh, have three chances. The record has fallen. Yeah, no. Okay. I know. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Return any time for another session. I will await for you. I'll come back here at another point in time. Maybe to get some more items like the, like I said, it's basically a challenge node, but for Bowser. So let's take a look at the new area that we're in here. I want, I want you for coins. Thank you. Was this, oh, was this back to Toe Town? Hey guys, it's B Bowser! How's it going, everybody? How are you? Oh, everybody left. Uh, and it's been blocked. The castle has been blocked with Bowser's greatest weakness, being not able to jump. So let's explore some of the things that we had the chance to explore, but we didn't have Bowser yet, so we couldn't take a look around beforehand. 
So that just looks like it goes back to the city area where this is. To the castle, where he can't get to. I like how nobody seems to care that Bowser's wandering around behind him. Especially with Peach's castle being right there. Like, yeah, we can, you know, let him in any time. No wonder Bowser succeeds at kidnapping Peach so often. The Toads just don't even care. Like, yeah, whatever. Do what you want. We can go back into the caves with Bowser if you want to as well. To take a look around with him. This went back to the security section where he got zapped before, but now it just doesn't work. So in case you need any thing with him down here, I don't think there's really a point though. Looks like we can't really explore too terribly much anyways. Toe Town, their inability to jump, has once again thwarted Bowser. I guess that's the best security you can get. So let's actually see where we are here. There's a pathway there. Oh, does this thing respond? Oh, yes it does! There we are. You can also take a look at the map at any time to see where we actually are. So we're trying to head towards Dimplewood, which I believe is in this general direction. So many things to explore, though. So I guess we'll just keep on going. Except we can't. Well, looks like there's only one way to go. And that's this way. Perhaps we'll learn a more stronger punch so we can break down that wall. Hey, we got ourselves a brand new enemy. Honeycombs. Let's suck up the honeycombs. Oh, maybe there's bees inside. Or honey. And blitties. Awesome. Oh no, bees! They should take a while to decide what you want to do. Oops, I should have punched him. Oh, they didn't give me the signal beforehand. But at least I can heal as much as I want to. I can just continually suck up honey. What if I suck up enough honey if the bees will just get angry? There we go. That's what I've been wanting to do. Aw, tricky delay. Alright, now that we're actually healed, let's punch this thing in the face. Oh, healing. Let's punch this one again here. These things are pretty easy to deal with. I'll see if they have a fire weakness after. Let's burn them. Yeah, I think it's just the trees that have fire weakness. And... One more punch out to do it. Kinda wish Bowser could equip badges, but he can't. I guess that makes some sense. He's got a lot of experience if he wants to gain some more levels. It feels like we haven't played Bowser in a very long time, which I guess is the case. So I'm gonna take care of the rest of the battles that are in here, so I'll be right back. So everything has been taken care of. Well, it was just the one thing, I suppose, so I guess I can't say everything. We'll have to come around the other side in order to get that down. Get those coins. I thought I saw a pathway over here, but I guess I'm just seeing things. Oops. Black Beach. Kind of backtracking here a little bit. You guys hear footsteps? Could it be Bowser? Who's that? It's us, sir. Your Koopa Trooper unit. King Bowser! Your awesomeness! Behind this rock wall, huh? Man, too hard. We're getting you back, guys! Bowser's, Bowser's here for us! He can't get through that wall, though, can he? Belay that talk, soldier. Bowser can break anything. 
Hey, yeah, you're right. That's why he's the king. Darn skip eight Bowser rules. <laughs> of course I'll break it. Those walls going down, baby. Of course you will, sir. That's our King Bowser. King Bowser! King Bowser! Crud, I've got to hit this thing with something big or no dice. Scratch that. Something huge. Guess I better go look. Something huge like giant Bowser? I could just step on it. Anyways, I'm going to take care of these honeycombs. Be right back. All of the enemies have been successfully defeated. Now to get the worm so I can get more coins. And I also saw an item box over here before we move on. There's a few different ways we can go. And then there's this little interesting little thing. Let's see what it does if I punch it. I was gonna say, I hope I didn't die, but now Bowser can swim! You know, I have to say, I really like the music of this little area here. And if we swim on top of this clamshell here, it'll bring us back to the surface. That felt nice. So, let's explore before we go in there a little bit. Oh, very good. So now we have a shortcut to get back in case we need to. So it looks like in order to break down those other really hard blocks, I have to approach it from the other direction. Let's check this area out here before we go too terribly far. Another shortcut. Lots of shortcuts. All right, now we can go swimming. I like that Bowser just gets willingly hit with this thing. It's like, wasn't even meant for anybody else, really. Just for Bowser. Don't need to go back up for any reason. Maybe there'll be some new underwater enemies in here. I also like the music when you switch back over to the brothers, too. It's nice. So naturally, we can't breathe fire while we're down here. Oh, I thought I could jump on him, but of course Bowser can't even jump. Anyways, I don't think I even showed this particular status before. When Bowser's on his back. I might have, I'm not too sure. Basically, it just works like paralyzation for Bowser. He's a turtle, so of course he has troubles when he's on his back. Beans? Hey, I want a bean. The first thing we have to check out, Liddy's. He also took out his teeth. Wonder if he's gonna run away now that he has, doesn't have his teeth. Oops, reacted to that a little bit too late. I like that how his uh, attack is now just banana peels. Oh, he can't chew it. And he gets himself dizzy. That's just amazing. I also leveled up and increased my defense while I was fighting those other things. You note to self, I cannot jump on top of things. I'm not Mario and Luigi. I don't know why I thought I could. Oops. Okay, I understand. So when it's a banana peel, I punch. When it's the other thing, I punch. I thought maybe the rock was a trick. Get away from me. Any of these things I fight, I will just edit out the battle, of course. Didn't give a lot of experience. Not enough for me, anyways. Oh, shoot. I'm gonna go take care of him, so I'll be right back. So I took care of all of the crocodiles. We can safely proceed. And we can get some of the items that are laying around here. There's one down here before we can continue. Oh, there's two there. Nice, I was able to get both. And one strike. Let's take this upper path first. Oh, it's a route back up. Let's get this first. I'm curious to see what else is underwater here before we continue. Oh, crocodile, be right back. 
Oh, and that's everything in this room, and there's actually another place we can go up here. So since we're in this area already, we might as well just take this one first. And we'll see where we end up. Oh, look at this. Things we can't do yet. And that's everything. Wow. What an exciting place that was. Does everything respawn? No, the game's, the game's not that mean to me. That's good. So since we tend to take that route, we might as well take this one. Maybe we'll be able to learn how to use that shell block in due time. Huh? A ship? If I punch that ship, I could break that wall. I love Bowser's reasoning to things. Like, yeah, I'm gonna punch the ship, and then we'll break the wall. Oops. There we go. Oops. I wanted to... I know what I wanted to do there, and I missed my chance. Does this end me up at the ship? I don't really want to go there quite yet. There's things that I saw that I want to do first. Oh, looks like I have no choice but to go back. All right, I suppose we'll look at the ship first and then we'll come back and get what I missed later. I hear something over here. It smells weird. Actually, it smells kind of good. Let's investigate. raining down. That's why Bowser's nose was itchy. You think we'll affect his body if we knock that pollen into his nasal walls? If you make yourself slide with the stylus, you'll repel the pollen. Like, say you trace this path for you two. Then you move on the path the stylus slid. Move like this, and bounce all the pollen into the walls. Alright, I'll give it a try without my mouse. Love how this makes absolutely no sense, though. Like, yeah, we'll just bounce pollen into your walls. When the pollen hits the walls, they change color. Use the pollen to change all the nasal walls' colors. Oh good, this is gonna take me 500 years. I like that Bowser is just still very interested in this, in these flowers, even though we're doing this. The only thing that I don't like about this mini game is that you have to start where Mario and Luigi are, like to touch it. Wow, that's quite a serious reaction. Next, you guys should slam into the swollen memory. Do it! This seems like a terrible idea. Whoa! This is a different kind of pollen. If you hit a spiky pollen, you, use, you lose one heart. Be careful not to lose all your hearts. Careful, don't hit the spiky pollen. Okay. Notice how you get to lose coins now. You'll see Bowser's reaction, too. Oop. Now, go. Oh, of course it moved at the last minute. Come on. Ah, oh, I didn't mean to do that. It keeps changing on me. I'm gonna head towards the... Oops. That was in the middle. That was in the middle at all. Stop. Okay, thank you. Go up. There we go. I slammed into it. Come on. That should count. I'm a little bit out of control here now. 
Okay, stop, stop. I wish there was a way I could stop. Like, while I'm in mid-spin here. Stop. Ah! Why does it not stop me? While I'm in the middle of spinning. Alright, I'm gonna try it again after we come back, so I'll see you guys in the next part.